before we get started, I just wanted to say that only a few of you, um, a small percentage of you guys are subscribed. So um, I'm just asking and please encouraging for you guys to subscribe because it would be a substantial thing for me and um, would help this um, channel fuel, seeing how I have so few. And um, But with that said, we're going to go ahead and get started. All right, well, for today's video, <clears throat> we're going to... Uh, I'm going to start some new saguaros. Um, so right here is a um, saguaro uh, cactus from Arizona. This one is probably 8 to 10 years old. Uh, well, it would be if it was grown from seed. I believe this is a cutting. Maybe. I'm not really for sure. But um, if it's not, well, then this is a decently old plant. Uh, so these will be results in 8 to 10 years from now. So yeah, they're very slow growers. But um, I don't mind things growing slow so I'm just gonna go through how to how I grow these um, so I have a mix of just potting soil and uh, py pyrite py I have a brain fart anyways you know what I'm talking about um, the 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 white substrate um, that helps drainage because you want to have really well draining soil even with the younglings um, I normally mix in sand but I didn't have any which doesn't matter, which I'm trying to figure out which is the best method. So this is one of the methods. Um, I'm going to aim it down to where you can see the seeds. They're very small. So you can see uh, there's probably around 300 there. Um, so I'm just going to set it right here, set the phone up to where you can uh, see them. Oh, let's go down. Um, so practically I just sprinkle the seeds around like this and uh, try to get as evenly as possible now these this is a larger pot but in my other one which I'll show you these what these will look like about after two weeks they are all grown together and I'm just gonna, some people use paper to help with these out but I'm just gonna drop it like so and uh, I'll show you what they'll turn out to look like in around two weeks so here is a batch right here and uh, these guys uh, germinate very well. As you can see, they're very really small still. But uh, I'm going to let them leave them in the bag. I'm slowly starting to open up the bag. I'm going to wait around uh, two weeks more. So I wait around a month before I open the bag fully. And then I start taking them out of the bag. And then I start watering them and watering them more because you want to make sure they don't dry out and die. And uh, then that's pretty much the whole process and uh, now that I did this um, you put this in a gallon size baggie which I'll do here in a second and uh, I'll show you uh, how to put it how to put it in the baggie how to seal it up and you also probably want to have a heat pad which will help germinating uh, percentages all right so I have my gallon size bag this one I was already using to grow something in so it's already um, fairly uh, hydrated I'm gonna get this in the bag now. And I'm gonna go get a spray bottle. All right, so now that I got the, the water bottle, I'm gonna do a heavy mist over it. Make sure everything's doused down. And then I take my hand and I apply pressure all the way around it, make sure the seeds are at least kind of pressed into the soil a little bit. Now check the back here. I'm gonna try to get all of back my hand because there's sometimes some seeds stuck on there. Like there's one right there on my ring finger. And um, now I got a few more in my hand. So, and spray a little bit more. Now I seal up the bag. Hard to do with one hand. it up all the way and I open it up about once a day after this because um, I wanted to make sure it has plenty of uh, or plenty of moisture and then I set it on the heating pad and uh, yeah that's about all you have to do I'm gonna label it um, but this is what it'll turn out to look like in the future um, but, um, here's also this, and I'll put a picture right here of, um, 
what they'll look like if you were to have them for a very long time and what they look like in the wild. Um, I'm just giving a little tour of all my stuff. Here's those um, saguaros again. And uh, here's some stuff I grew. And here's some, these are one year old. I'm not even sure what they are because I didn't label them. I wasn't thinking. So these are one year old um, something. And um, yeah, these are just some of the stuff I have inside. And um, in the future, here in a few days, I'll do a tour of my greenhouse and show all my um, cactus and uh, plants and stuff. So, um, but that will be it for today. So thank you for watching and please subscribe.